Hi hey, YouTube, uh, what's up? Well, I'm gonna teach you how to make like a text reader and writer. <laughs> and uh, it's pretty cool because you can make, make a notepad or something and it reads it from a text file and it saves it to a text file which you modify it. So um, just make like a no, just make a button to open to locate your text file. So I'll just type in open. This isn't gonna look very good. It's just gonna teach you the basics and uh, make a text box. Make sure it's multi-line. Then leave room for another button if you want to build it like this. And I'm just gonna make it say. Whoop, Control Z, Control Z. I don't know what just happened. Make it say, uh, save. And, uh, now uh, double click this, the open, and uh, we're gonna add an import. And import, just type in import dot system dot IO. And that's input output. Because readers and writers work with that. So, uh, dim, nope, not yet. yet. Um, dim open f as new open file dialog. Then, uh, let's go ahead and make a try statement. So, and it should go ahead and fin finish it for you. Then, uh, op oh no, well, no, let's add some of the features to the open file dialog. So, open f dot file name equals uh choose a file open f dot initial directory is going to equal c colon backslash so that's the default partition on your hard drive and then uh well it should be hopefully it is try so open f dot show dialog and then after that, uh, we'll go ahead and make a reader. So dim, eh, reader as string equals uh, dim reader as new io dot stream reader, and then colon. Oh, this will give you the file path dot file name, which is the thing you selected. Then dim text as new now as string equals reader dot read to end yeah oh yeah and we're gonna have to make a public uh, string so dim for the file location to save to file loc as String, yeah, it was nothing so far. And then text box one dot text equals text. So now when you open it, it'll do that. It'll show the text here. Then I hit save, and the save thing will be um, dim writer as new io dot stream writer colon not colon file location which is the same location that you opened it as so there's no save as feature you'll have to save it to this location the one that you open it with which will modify the previous text file so then uh, writer dot write line and then in here put in text box one dot text there, uh, this should work now. So I'll hit open. I have one already made. It says poop, then more poop. And then if I mo modify it, make it say, uh, gays are cool. Then hit save. Oh, yeah, I forgot to do this. Gotta make that. Oh yeah, and while I'm at it, uh, every time you hit the button, make it do uh, clear the text box. Okay, now it'll work. Sorry. 
open the text file Hey, boop, more boop Hello World Save Oh, last thing, <laughs> sorry You need to always end each one of these readers you make So reader.close and writer dot close. I always forget that. Sorry. Open desktop. Hello world. Was up. Save. Yay. Worked. So now when I hit open desktop, go back to it. It's just that. See. Yeah. Simple enough, right? Is R Brown Save Not open Yeah, pretty much it. Uh thank you guys for watching and uh Yeah, pretty much it. Thank you. Bye.